Good morning. Hello guys, good morning, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. I look terrifying, I know, my hair is a disgusting mess. That is because I'm getting my hair done today. As you can see, I have roots right now because I've just been getting like my hair highlighted and I'm gonna go back to getting platinum. But I'm just doing my skincare. First thing, I always put this cream on, Confidence in a Cream by A Cosmetics. Best moisturizer literally ever. And then next, I always use this Sunbum Glow face sunscreen. It's in my opinion okay well now it's all over the floor it's literally like the best because it gives your skin like a tiny tint and it makes you super glowy i think i put too much because i can't see what i'm doing on the camera put some down here too maybe like i literally look oily right now and then after i do that i use this first aid beauty little niacinamide eye cream just a dab and i put it under my eyes because it kind of brightens them up as you can see it's also very glowy I feel like i'm on one of those like the vogue beauty videos and then you can see literally my skin is so glowy put on some deodorant because you don't want to stink and last but not least my absolute favorite thing ever i have like five of these just like around they're the best ever your lips will be so soft and smell so good once again i'm not even gonna bother with my hair because it's about to get done it's literally like I think it's 7.30 right now. And I'm getting my hair done at 9.30. So let's find a new outfit. I'm going to put on gym clothes. So I'm going to go over here. I'm here with my dresser. See all these clothes? Need to put them all away. All right. Let's see. I usually just go with something simple. So I'm just going to wear this little tank top funny story actually one time i was getting my hair done and obviously when you're getting your hair done you're wearing like the cape thing the whole time i was wearing this tank top that i knew would always slide down but i, I was just like it's fine i'll just keep pulling it up whatever so when the cape was on it must have slid down pretty far my hair girl which like i don't really care but her and the, this other girl that was helping her at the time they took it off and i'm facing the mirror and they're behind me like looking and my nipples were out and i was like oh my god I was like, I'm so sorry. But yeah, funny story. So this one I'm going to wear. Some little gray bike shorts from Naked Wardrobe. This tank top from Urban. And then my absolute favorite little comfy zip-ups from Skims. Now I need to make my bed. I need to edit some little TikTok Instagram videos for the podcast. And then I need to get going. snacks because i literally sit there for so long i do have extensions so i have to get those moved up as well if there's anything i've learned being in my 20s and living on my own it's that cleaning never stops i also just got these white fake tulips because obviously tulips are toxic to cats and these last forever and they look so pretty in here Posey, you want some food my baby is it too sunny for you is it better <laughs> look at her chest she's brown like right here because she sits in the sun every day she was already like really dark brown right there but now it's lightened it and it's like almost orange now right you got some highlights on your chest huh i'll be back later i put on my amazon slides everyone makes fun of these because they say they look like shower shoes but i love them and they're comfortable so i'm gonna wear them and continue to wear them okay time to go I need to get gas. Typical me, everywhere I go, anytime I have somewhere to be at a certain time, I'm literally on E and I have no choice but to stop even though I don't have time because I want to get Starbucks and then I'm gonna end up late because I literally have 20 minutes before I have to actually like leave to go to the hair salon because it's like 30 minutes away, so whatever. Let's just hope I make it. Let's go fill up $85 worth of gas because gas is literally Oh, it actually went down. $4.49. What a deal. Update. I 
kick yes i forgot my wallet at home i literally want to smack myself in the face i am so annoyed at myself right now because now i have to literally go back home <laughs> I'm gonna run out of gas on the side of the road. All right, secured the wallet at the gas station. Probably going to have the tiniest bit of time to try and get Starbucks, so let's, fingers crossed, the line isn't long because I haven't eaten breakfast, so I literally have to go and get something. Otherwise, it will not survive in the freaking salon. Hi, can I please get a tall ice white mocha with a sweet cream cold foam and then caramel drizzle? Can I also get a bottle of water, the cheese and fruit protein box, and then a turkey bacon egg white sandwich and that is my Starbucks order of the day I'm gonna get a sandwich and then I got a protein box so I can eat that when I'm there those usually fill me up a little bit thank god the line was short today because honestly I wouldn't have made it I got gasoline on my hands and then stink now I sprayed like a ton of hand sanitizer but I feel like that can't really fix it oh also Jesse and I I told you guys in my last video our one year is in a couple days on the 25th so he knows I love Cartier he got me this Cartier love ring with the little diamonds in it this one Kennedy got me and he got me this one so now I have them both on my one finger Brandon got me one also for a video I did for him the prize was a Cartier ring and I believe that one got stolen at the gym because I put it in my gym bag like an idiot. Alrighty, got my order. I actually got the wrong size. I meant to get a venti, but that's fine. This drink is seriously so good. It's like not something I get every day because it is really sweet. I was feeling a little frisky this morning, so I decided to get this. It's so good. It's like dessert in a cup. And actually, I thought it was going to be late. I'm going to be right on time, literally like two minutes late max. I'm supposed to be there at 9.30. It's 25 minutes away. My phone says it will be there by 9.32. So, wow, pretty impressive. Forgot my wallet. Got Starbucks. Still gonna be on time. Really impressed with myself today. And I got all the work done that I needed to get done. I'm gonna turn the camera off and drive now considering it's going crooked. Oh, we're gonna make it. We're just gonna go through the red light. Oops, okay. All right. <laughs> Bye, guys. All right, my extensions are all out and I just wanna show the progress my hair has made it's so much longer and thicker i mean the ends are still like kind of gross and ratty but made a lot of progress with extensions and then now we're gonna get rid of these fruits and put on some high lift color and hopefully i will be a fully platinum blonde by the end <laughs> without as much damage <laughs> so let's do it what happened obviously my hair is not platinum bleach blonde at the top like it is going to be if you can see it's a lot lighter than it seems on camera honestly because like the car is dark above my head but okay you can kind of tell there it's pretty blonde <sighs> Been a long day i went to the salon at 9 30 and i just got home and it's 5 16. so basically what happened was i wanted to try to do an alternative to bleaching because i wanted to kind of like save my hair and not damage it as much so we tried a high lift color she tested a strand of my hair just to make sure that it like wasn't sensitive to my scalp that it would lift enough and all of the above everything looked good so she went ahead and put it on put me under these big heat lamps and within like 10 minutes or so i was like okay it burns right here specifically like pretty bad and that's like not normal because i get bleach on my hair so i kind of know what the burning feels like and it was more than that and so she ended up checking it and she was like it looks red and i want to take it off because it made her nervous and she like was like i don't want you to have any like sores or scabs or anything on your head so basically what it came down to is what i at least what we think happened is that i have like a dry spot back here on my head and it was sensitive when she put that on it like burned it a little bit i guess i don't really know because the rest of my head is fine so basically she just kind of toned it we did two bleach baths and she was very like gentle with them my hair is still completely healthy and fine as you can see but it's just not as blonde as i would want it to be at the top so i'm going back in a week and she's just gonna bleach it and everything will be fine but if you guys saw it the few times that she was checking it to dry it to see how it looked it was orange it was orange i was a little bit scared i'm not gonna lie i think she was a little bit scared she ended up putting this gray toned dye conditioner it's like a pigment i think on my roots it's not a toner it 
was different than that, I think. And that ended up like wrapping it all together. And obviously it's not her fault. She didn't know that my head was gonna get freaking burned by that stuff. I'm very impressed that she got it from what it was to what it is now. So that was that, that was my day, you know, definitely spent much longer than we both thought. Now Jesse's gonna come over, he's bringing over some Indian food for dinner because I'm starving. All I've eaten was Starbucks and a protein bar. So I'm feeling kind of weak. My bubby brought me Indian food for dinner. Oh yeah. I have some of this. What is it called? Vindaloo, chicken vindaloo, I think. Yeah, that's what it is. It's like potatoes, tomato-y like vinegar base and it's so good. And then you get it with this. Non bread. This oh, yeah, non bread is so good, oh my mm, gosh. Good. This stuff is so good. It's made like fresh homemade. <laughs> wow, great shot. This is the headless vlog. <laughs> we don't have heads. You should see this fucking setup. Oh my god, I'm just uh, that's just dangerous. It's dinner time. Oh, yeah, this is too spicy for me. God, it's so good though. Mm. Hey, give me some of your sauce, you stealer. You want a medium. No, you stole my sauce. This girl's stealing everything. It's funny when you were filming my Andrew Tate video, my workout section. I know, I told you, you I just said kept I didn't giggling, know you could hear me. But I was just filming you just now, and I'm giggling. It's just because we laugh at each other, it's not really that funny. We just like each other so much, like, we, like. Oh, I just think you're a loser and weird, so that's why I laugh at you. What the fuck? <laughs> I'm kidding. You okay. smell like sunscreen, why? I was out sunbathing, saving the moms at the pools. I was like, oh look, that mom's drowning. Give her mouth to mouth. Mm. She doesn't even care, she's that hungry. You're so fucking good. My stupid stories. Anyway, we're gonna eat this yummy dinner. And then maybe if I'm lucky, my boyfriend will take me to Sweet Frog later. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> All right, it's been about like two days or so, three days, two days. It's Saturday, I got my hair done Thursday. As you can see, it really is like a dark blonde, almost like brown type of color. But I will say, I'm really glad she did take it off and didn't just like leave it on because I have scabs in the back of my head. I can feel them. Yeah, that could have been really bad. I think that product, something about it just didn't, do well on my head so yeah next week should be a better hair session just so no one says anything it wasn't natalie my hairstylist's fault she's great she's amazing i've been going to her for five years we kind of went through the decision together and she couldn't have known she even did like a test strip and this didn't happen so psa don't don't blame her it's definitely not her fault that's all for now i'm gonna go to the gym it's been a few days since i went to the gym so Gotta get back into it. Oh, it looks lighter here. You can really see. Different lightings are like different colors. I don't know. I'm just glad that it's healthy and still attached to my head. Okay? Okay. Maybe I can vlog next week when I go and get my hair actually flattened and blonde. <laughs> All right, it is a week since I last got my hair done. I'm here at the salon and I'm getting it fixed today. Finally, I'm so excited. My head's pretty much like healed from the like reaction it had to the high lift color and as you can see this is my roots now i did shower once so it kind of like washed out any of the gray toner not too bad it really isn't as bad as it, it seems it's actually kind of worse in person yeah so i wanted to finish off the video on a good note and show you guys the end result after all of this nonsense but anyway without further ado i'm gonna go this long <laughs> beautiful my scalp actually was completely fine it pretty much healed i guess from the last time it's just like a little bit dry from the allergic reaction or whatever whatever happened to my head because of that like formula of dye but yeah it looks so great i'm so happy from now on we will be sticking to bleach because clearly my skin is very sensitive to something that is in that product which is just crazy because like today it got bleached no pain no burning nothing completely fine but yeah it's still like super soft and everything now i'm gonna go inside and check on the cats because i have two cats now murphy and posy murphy's in my room and posy is out in the rest of the apartment they're not together yet because we're just not there yet. I got him yesterday, so they need to get used to each other. They're both still hissing at each other. Hopefully in the next week or so, they're fine, but let's go see them. In one corner, we have Mosby. Hi, Bob. Oh, I feel so bad. She's been out here because I can't bring her to see Murphy. He's crying in here. What are you 
you doing, bud? Here's Murphy. Look at those beautiful eyes. He literally slept all night on my face. He couldn't get comfortable, but he wanted to sleep like literally right here, like on top of my neck. What are you doing? What are you doing? You ready to play? Oh my gosh, he's so cute. Oh, you're so cute and beautiful. He's finally got some energy. He slept all day yesterday because I think he was just overwhelmed with the fact that I brought him here. But now he's warming up. <laughs> Hi, bud. Oh, 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 you're so cute, huh? You're so cute, huh? <laughs> I think that's it for this vlog. He is so Look at him. He's just perfect. Hope you liked coming along on this little unexpected hair journey, but we made it and that's all that matters. So love you guys. I'm going to go head to the gym and spend some time with the cats trying to get them. Oh, excuse me, sir. Trying to get them to love each other because you're siblings. Love you guys. And thank you so much for watching. Say bye. <laughs> bye.